So when I first came to med school, I heard a lot of people tell me that med school is not hard, it's just like eating pancakes. And if you eat two pancakes a day, by the end of the week, you're gonna have eaten a lot of pancakes and you're gonna be good. But if you skip a day and you don't eat two pancakes for one day, then you have to eat like six pancakes or like catch up later. And today it looks like I'm gonna eat 567 pancakes. Okay, it's Monday and that means there is another weekly quiz. Fill you guys in on why this week is like a little bit crazy. So today's Monday. On Thursday we have a mini and that's like a, an exam where we're basically like playing doctor. Um, so you walk into a patient, you do a history, you take a, do a physical. Friday is the infectious disease exam, the one that I said is like a, a lot of things that you have to memorize. Um, so that's Friday. And then on the following week is a scholar's workshop. Hey guys. How you guys feel about this week? All right, I'm ready just, to get it over with. Um, so we're about to walk into the quiz now and then it's just grind time for the rest of the week. You can't record us, you can't record us. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, four. It's gonna be this kind of week. Yeah, we are. You hear them still uh, sizzling? Okay. So beautiful. So I've been watching um, curling on. <laughs> We've been watching curling okay. a lot while studying. Why is it and I feel like I've been watching it for a few days that now, and I have absolutely no idea electric. how this scoring works. So if anybody could fill me in, how anyone is there overtime who's a professional across? curler on here, please write in the box how the hell this works. Sure. I'm in the middle of studying, and a lot of people have said to use Sketchy for this block, and I have been doing that, but I feel like my own mnemonics are sometimes a little bit better just for me to remember. So I made one for Scarlet Fever, and I'm going to share it with you guys. We're in this scene, there's Scarlett Johansson and she has a huge red necklace on and that's gonna symbolize pharyngitis. Then she's walking out of this party um, and as she's walking out, she's eating a strawberry and that's symbolizing strawberry tongue. And then, oh, let me show you guys. And then she is, after she eats a strawberry, she realizes she's allergic and she breaks out in hives and this is gonna be the rash. And then she's so itchy because this rash is itchy that she takes off her glove to itch and that's desquamation during recovery. And that's all I got. So. Let's see if this works. Okay, I realize I have to add something to this little mnemonic of mine. Um, so we are here, Scarlet Fever. She's at a party for A-listers because this is caused by group A strep. And the reason she's leaving the party and she's running out, you know, like in a rush and about to get this rash, it's about to get crazy, is because the people in there were really toxic and it's caused by an exotoxin. So I think I just covered everything in that and hopefully I did, I don't know. Yeah. All right. I just got my first shipment of um, HelloFresh. It just came in the mail. So, cool. I'm just opening everything up now and just how cute that they give you every single thing you need. When you wake up to this again, you almost forgot it was a thing. Yeah, the morning of our mini OSCE exam so um, we have like class before it because the Eagles parade threw everything off this is the the thing where we act like doctors and we walk into an, um, an SP's room so an SP is a standardized patient they are trained to put on this like act for us as if they're an actual patient so we can practice our doctoring skills Man, I'm tired but um, so right now I have class. It's my test in about, is in about two hours, so I'm gonna wait for my class mates. What? What's happening? So crisis is averted, and we everyone's just late, I guess. Pavan, where the hell were you? Yeah, you were. Okay, you ready? Come on, girl. <laughs> Are you it's okay? Just a long day. Yeah, and lots of long... required things. Yeah. Did you have your thing yet? Did you have your morning? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And when's your OSCE? 145. Are you ready? I'm feeling it. Are you ready for the exam tomorrow? I'm... <laughs> Slow down there, chief. <laughs> um, so we just finished the practice... No, I don't even know what that was. What? <laughs> <laughs> um, what's up, Alec? Um, so we did that. Now I'm going to go get breakfast. So my biggest issue with... Hey, girl. 
My biggest issue is that I talk as if I'm on like five times speed. Mike, how'd it go? Yeah, we're uh, following it went you. Okay. Good? Yeah, we're yeah. pretty good. Are you guys ready for your actual ASCII? I'm ready for strong breath. Yeah, I feel ya. It's time to get out of this clothes and into, into this study outfit. Let's go. If it looks like I'm moving into school, it's because I basically am for the night. It's gonna be a long night. Mike, how long are you staying here? Tell my eyes, please. <laughs> um, it is five. And this is what's happening. Oh, Papa. <laughs> Can you? Oh, Turtle socks. <laughs> Etia, Brelia, and Katiella are all somewhat similar and can easily be confused. Anna, who said so right away, we want to let you know that for testing purposes, Katiella does not cause a rash. It's super late. I'm really tired. Just a blanket on my head. And my roommate and I just did a bunch of practice problems. Um, so hopefully I know what I need to know. I'm gonna wake up in a few hours and take the test. I'm not a fan of med school right now at all. Hey, follow me on Instagram. Yes. <laughs> it is time. It's time. Oh, no one's okay. No, no. one's okay. Okay, <laughs> out of here. Yeah, it's a, this was a rough one is all I'm going to say. We're about to go see what happens. Link is below. Can you get out of here? But yeah, this is, good this, just for today. this is a rough one, but we're going to do great because we all studied hard and I don't, oh, I don't know. It's a, <laughs> it's scary. We're, we're gonna go through that door right now my to our death. Number is six on that. Oh my god. Here we go. <laughs> we're all here. <laughs> About to start the exam. I'm taking my phone out in a sec. Somebody asked why we have computers. We don't actually have access to internet while we're in the exam. We have to use a thing. So I'm gonna get this out before I get in trouble. We just finished the exam and. That might be the one to get me out of med school. That was really, 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 really hard. And I'm out before everyone, which I usually am not. So I'm like, did I really mess up? Yeah, I'm kind of freaking out. Hey guys. Okay, so uh, exam week is over. Thank God it was rough. It was crazy rough. The exam was extremely difficult. Um, for me, I don't know if I did something wrong or if everyone in my class felt that way because I left right after the exam, so I didn't really talk to anyone. But I thought it was really, really hard. Um, and I won't know my grade for like a week and a half, so I can either sit here and stress for a week and a half until I find out my grade, or I can just chill, enjoy my time, enjoy my life, and then in a week and a half, then I can deal with the grade if it's a bad one. But there's nothing I can do right now, so what's the point of stressing? I mentioned in this video that I was gonna do HelloFresh for the first time this week, so. Um, I got a week's worth of food this week. I was waiting until I actually like tried it to see if it was worth it And I can definitely say now that that was the best thing for me to do during exam exam week Especially because I just don't have the time to go um, To go shopping or to even think about like what kind of meals I want to cook so it was extremely convenient I just wanted to show you guys the website so you can see how easy it is to navigate um, This week all of my meals came with pre-measured and labeled ingredients and all the meals took about 30 minutes to prepare I received three different recipes and they change weekly and I was able to spend, save so much time and energy that I would have spent going to the grocery store even meal prepping by doing this. If you followed me for a while you know that I love cooking and to be able to try meals that were out of my comfort zone was so much fun and I definitely think I'm going to do it again. So I was actually able to pair up with them to give um, you guys a, a promo code. The promo code is MAHA30 so you can get $30 off your first week which I think is great. I'm, I'm going to use my own promo code. Um, so. Try that and let me know if you guys liked it. But other than that, I'm just gonna chill for, again, I might have a week and a half before I cry, so I'm gonna enjoy this week and a half. If you guys have any questions, I, I'm trying to answer all of them, but if there's anything I'm missing, please write it down below. If you guys have any suggestions about how not to feel like crap after an exam, please let me know. And I'll see you guys next time, bye.